players, experts in our field. And this is a four-man crew. The mechanic, the B&E specialist, the safe cracker. Now me, I'm the wise-ass wise man. Thank you so much for joining us here on the set today of A Perfect Plan. William, what interested you most about this character? I look at Grayson as being a man who's a great artist. He's somebody that is really good at what he does. He's not a compromiser, he doesn't bend. Right, reality TV. You have to admire the humor of the situation. Four thieves, locked up, and we haven't even committed a crime. I don't what you're talking about. I'm a law avoiding citizen. Someone went to a lot of trouble to bring us here, so whatever the score is, it's got to be worth it. It's diamonds. A lot of diamonds. What makes you think they're going to do what you want them to do? They have no choice. Did they build a replica of the museum? They want us to practice the heist. They're going to watch our every move and when we're done. Kate, to me, is really interesting. I think that what I'm, what I'm having fun exploring is that she sort of reluctantly became a lone wolf because she was brought up in a really storied family, a family that, that had a history um, in crime. She's cut up. You don't say. Granddaughter of the great Bingham himself. I don't trust her. And then after uh, an event happened and something went wrong, she was sort of cut loose from the family. And this is now the process of her finding her clan again. I tried so hard and got so... I don't think you understand the variables here. We're pawns. Pawns in something much bigger. We live or we die. Doesn't sound like much of a choice to me. I had to you're gonna have to be a hell of a lot smarter about all this if you all intend to get out of here alive. This isn't gonna end the way you think it will. Thank you.